Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you the timing marks for the crankshaft and the camshaft on a Kohler Command engine. Now I've got the engine on my table. It's actually a vertical engine from a lawn tractor. And it's out of this snapper lawn tractor and the engine is a 12.5 horsepower. And I've got it sitting up like this just so that it would be easier to show you guys the timing marks. First of all, this is the crankshaft. This is the camshaft and this is a balance shaft. Not every engine will have this balance shaft over here. So the timing marks for the crankshaft and the camshaft are as follows. There's a little mark over here and there's a small mark on the crankshaft. And here are the marks up close. And there it is. Again, this is the crankshaft over here and this is the camshaft. You're going to see there's a small letter. It says S and here I made a mark with a black marker. And on the balance shaft, the marks are over here. This is the balance shaft over here, and this is the mark on the crankshaft. Just simply a little indented dot over here. So you want to make sure that these are lined up if ever you have to take this off. A good thing to do is when you take off the sump cover is look inside, turn the crankshaft to line up the marks just to make double sure when you put it back together that you have the exact marks that you saw when you took it off. And sometimes if you need to turn the crankshaft, you can put the bolt for the pulley, use a wrench and then turn it around like this. And that's when you want to make sure that when you turn the engine that the marks are going to line up. It's pretty simple, it's easy to do. Anybody watching the video here will be able to do it. On this shaft here, it's pretty easy. There's only one mark, so you cannot mix it up. But on the camshaft, there's a few little dots here as well, including the one for the timing mark. So when you take the sump cover off, always look inside to see where the notch on the crankshaft lines up on the camshaft. Just so that when you put the camshaft back in, you're not wondering if it was one of these that had to be lined up with a notch on the crankshaft. So that's where the timing marks line up on your Kohler Command engine. Thanks for watching guys. Make sure to subscribe and we'll see you next time. Have a nice day.